Climate Central has been analyzing cities across the country since the 1970s. Their study places El Paso as number three on the list of cities with the fastest increase in temperatures during the summer months. And ABC 7's Tyon Marshburn has more. The study found that many cities across the United States experienced more abnormal summer days than in the 1970s. The desert southwest has seen some of the strongest rises in temperatures. Climate Central studied 241 cities across the U.S. during the months of June, July, and August. 230 of those cities reported seeing summer temperatures increase by an average of 2.5 degrees. Top five cities included Reno, Nevada, Boise, Idaho, El Paso, Texas, Las Vegas, Nevada, and Salt Lake City, Utah. Greg Lundin, a meteorologist with National Weather Service, says that high pressures in the area keep the overnight temperatures from dropping. El Paso's seen a lot of growth over the years too, and that's allowed you know temperatures to rise just from all the pavement, concrete. But I really think it's just we've seen a general pattern shift right now, and we're we're just waiting to see you know, how permanent it becomes and how extensive. El Paso wasn't the only city in Texas on the list. There was also Houston, McAllen, Austin, Odessa, and Bryan. I think we're going to see longer, drier, hot summers. You know, that that's about the trend we can see right now because that has been the trend over actually the last couple decades. So far this year, El Paso has had 54 triple digit days, which is less than last year, but El Paso has seen low temperatures that are higher than average. It's a difficult science because, you know, we things take place over not just weeks, days, months, years, decades, and even centuries. For more information on heat and climate change, look for this story on KVIA.com. Reporting, Tyon Marshburn, ABC7.